You know, Phil keeps on telling me I don't have the right to teach music because of a lack of a music theory PhD or whatever. Telling me how some doctor so-and-so over there is totally better than me because he really knows his crap. It's like, whatever, Phil. As for me, it's true. I don't really take the time to get to know my crap. I mean, to be honest, as soon as I see my crap, I just flush it down the toilet. So no, I don't know it very well. Like, like right when my crap says hi, I say goodbye with a roaring vawoosh. The toilets today aren't worthy of the name. They come in designer colors and they're too low. When you flush them, they make this little weak, almost apologetic sound. <laughs> Not the first. And when you flush it, vawoosh. <laughs> You know, I, I think the real question here is not how well Dr. So-and-so really knows his crap, but rather why Dr. So-and-so really knows his crap. I mean, it's kind, of, it's kind of strange. I would think that somebody who really knows their crap would be a doctor of, like, nutrition or something, rather than, like, a music doctor. Anyways, whatever, I don't even care. Because it's now time to cut the crap, so we can get to learning the guitar. And if you want to really get to know your crap, you can do it on your own time. By the way, I have learned a lot from highly musically educated people providing free content, which I'm very grateful for. I'm happy to listen to anybody as long as they're providing useful information. I'm just kidding here. So in any case, let's get to it.